Hallelujah to Jesus. Father, we bless your holy name. We worship you. A shout of days be glorified in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. This is God's own channel with Evangelist Sarah. You are welcome. The Lord bless you. The Lord bless every member of this household. It is well with you. Jesus love you. And I love you. Please, family, like this video. Share, subscribe. Tell somebody about this ministry. God bless you as you do that. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to Jesus. There are a lot of sadness among the children of enemy. Among the children of Satan. You know, Satan is the enemy of Christ. Is our enemy. So Satan also have children. So there's a lot of things going on among the children of Satan. They are not happy. They are not happy. Somebody, you are progressing. You are progressing in the Lord. You might be asking, you might you might want to say, ah, Evangelist Sarah, but I have not received what I prayed for last month. No. How am I happy? I'm very sad, man. No, child of God. If God keep you to see this day, this moment that you are hearing me, it is because God has a special purpose for your life. It is because your destiny is not over yet. It is because God has interest in your life. You must always remember that every new day comes with a hope. Every new day comes with a hope. And seeing a new day is not a right. It is a privilege. That is why we can boldly say this is the day that the Lord has made. We will rejoice and be glad in it because we know we are not the one that make the day. It is the privilege that God has given us for us to see the day. Hallelujah. For us to see the brand new day, for us to see the glory, the sun, the moon, the rain, the whatever, the breeze, the cold, the heat, the whatever weather that comes by. It is not we that created those things. It is the privilege that God has given to us for us to walk in it and live in it and, and stay in it and enjoy it and possess the things that he wants us to possess in it. He said he has given us the power, the authority that we should take dominion over everything. Hallelujah. Glory to Jesus. Now, child of God, you might be asking yourself, oh, how am I progressing? You are progressing for you to still be able to be standing where you are right now, for you to be able to still say, thank you, Lord Jesus. Yes, child of God, that is a progress. Sometimes you have to celebrate those things that you see as little win. They are not little win at all. They are big. When you celebrate it, the enemy becomes so unhappy. Because they see that now you are progressing. You are not only concentrating on your problems, but you are concentrating on God. There are many Christians who, who concentrate so much on their problem and they forget the God that can solve the problem. They focus on their request so much and they forget the God that grant the request. It is God that grant the request of me. Hallelujah. But many of us will concentrate on those things and will forget about the one that can make those requests become a reality. When you are able to focus on God and you know that, oh, it is God that brings the solution to the request you have submitted to the Lord, the supplication that you are bringing to the Lord, all you can do is pray and have faith. It is God that answers prayer. So when you have that prayer life, when you have that faith, that is progress. You don't know how God is going to do it, but you just leave it in the hands of God. That is progress. These are the things that is not making your enemy to be happy. That is why I said the children of Satan, they are not happy with you. They are not happy with you. That is why they keep holding meeting about your progress. About your life. How are you progressing? They thought that you were supposed to be down. But they see you wake up every day. You are like, ah, this is the day. And you are like, oh, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death. You are like, wow, the Lord will lead me beside the still water. You are like, oh, thank you, Jesus, for this day. Take over. You are gone. You are gone. You have gone to what you want to do. You have gone to the place you want to go. They are like, how possible is this? Child of God, you are progressing. You are improving in life. I want you to know that it is well with you. Jesus love you. And I love you with the love of Christ. I remain your sister, Evangelist Sarah. By the grace of God, I will see you again. Bye-bye.